Hey guys, this is Chef from Pat College. We're here in Austin for South by Southwest, um, and our reader Amal had a, sent us a question. He wants to get a tablet PC. He was thinking about getting the Dell Latitude XT2. Um, and we did some look at this, um, and it's about like 2,500 bucks for like a sort of underpowered laptop that you can rotate the screen around and turn it over and use it as a touch screen. And I would probably recommend against this because it's as much you could buy two MacBooks and an iPad for that cost. And in my experience, using a touch screen on a Windows 7 device um, is just not as good an experience as using like an iPad. This is the one I picked up yesterday because like this interface is designed from the ground up to be used with your fingers and Windows 7 is definitely not. I mean, Windows 7 is fine if you have a mouse and a keyboard, but that's honestly probably all you're gonna end up using the Dell for. You just can keep it in laptop mode because that's what it's used best as. So I would recommend getting, you know, a laptop that's a little cheaper and a little more powerful and maybe an iPad too. Yeah, I agree. Um, Emily and I both like to use our uh, Kindles when we like to do some reading. So it's an alternative to uh, the iPad if you just want to use it for reading school books or reading for fun outside of school. Um, it's really going to come down to what you want the tablet PC for. If you're wanting the tablet PC to take notes or to, I don't know what else you would really want the touchscreen for, but uh, you know, for whatever, for that kind of thing, then yeah, you're probably going to be better off with a decent, just typical laptop and an iPad or other dedicated tablet PC device. If you're using it to read things on, you want something you can hold, then that's going to be painful anyway. So go ahead and get a standard laptop and get a Kindle or something, yeah. or any of the other competing e-readers. Um, for the kinds of things that you would be using the touchscreen functionality for, any of the dedicated devices with an appropriate laptop is going to be cheaper and easier to use. I agree. Something that's going to combine both of them is going to make each of the laptop and touchscreen not as good. You're better off getting something that's dedicated to do one thing and then dedicated to the other thing as best as they both can. Yeah, so devices that specialize in one thing are usually a little bit better than things that try to do everything. Yes, and cheaper. And cheaper. Most definitely. So we think that's the best use of your money. So let us know what you do at home. Yeah.